is the fourth largest economy in the world after the US, China and Japan. India's transport sector is large and diverse. It caters to the needs of 1.1 billion people. In 2010, the sector contributed about 5.5% to the nation's GDP, with road transportation contributing the lion's share. It has been very well accepted by the government of India as well as various state and local governments that the overall development of the nation is not possible without good transportation infrastructure. As a consequence, in the last two decades, many large infrastructure projects have been implemented all over India. Some of the projects already completed or under construction include the Mumbai Pune Expressway, the Golden Quadrilateral Project, the Kongan Railway, the Bandravalli Sea Link, the Delhi Metro, the Mumbai Metro, the Bangalore Metro, the Bangalore Airport, the Hyderabad Airport, and the Multimodal International Hub Airport at Nagpur, Mihan. Organizing a premium conference like WCTR will give the necessary impetus for transportation research in India. Government agencies, transportation professionals and researchers will get opportunities to interact with participants from around the world and they will learn about their practices. To summarize, the WCTR conference can be a turning point for transportation engineering in India. Mumbai is the capital of Maharashtra, the most industrialized state in India, with a population of approximately 12.5 million. Mumbai is the commercial and entertainment capital of India, generating 5% of India's GDP and accounts for 25% of industrial output. Urban rail system, public bus transit, and paratransit are the backbones of Mumbai. The government of Maharashtra and local agencies, with the help of the World Bank, is implementing many mega projects. The Verli Bandra Sea Link, the Mumbai Metro, the Mumbai Monorail, and the Navi Mumbai Airport are some of the landmark projects that are transforming the landscape of Mumbai. Mumbai being the financial capital of India is connected by air from almost all important cities in the world. Mumbai also has very good air connectivity within India. IIT Bombay is part of Global Alliance of Technological Universities. IIT Bombay has a track record of hosting mega events from technical to cultural, namely tech fests, mood indigo, etc. Established in 1958, IIT Bombay is one of the most globally acclaimed academic institutions in India. It is also the most sought out destination for undergraduate and graduate students. Over the years, there has been great progress at IIT Bombay with respect to research activities with a parallel development in the facilities and infrastructure to keep it at par with the best institutions in the world. The Civil Engineering Department at IIT Bombay ranks the highest among other such departments in India. The Transportation Systems Engineering Group here is well established with high caliber faculty who have done pioneering work in the last 25 years. Civil Department at IIT Bombay ranks the highest in India. Transportation Systems Engineering Group of IIT Bombay is well established with skilled and the highest caliber faculty who have done pioneering work over the last 25 years. The group has a long and rich experience of holding international as well as national conferences, seminars and workshops setting a trend. The group will be celebrating its Silver Jubilee International Conference that is 10th TPMDC on December 2012. 
The group has been very active at WCTR. After experience of holding various international and national conferences, we believe that TSEG is capable of holding any conference of high stature like WCTR with confidence and sincerity. The Transportation Systems Engineering TSC program was started in 1988. Currently, TSC group consists of five faculty members, 15 PhD students, about 30 master students and about 10 project staff. The TSC group has a long history of conducting world-class research with special interest in transportation problems specific to India and developing countries. The faculty members are also actively involved in the national and local level consultancy in the areas of transport planning traffic engineering and pavement design. Since 1994, transportation planning and implementation methodologies for developing countries, TPMDC, a biannual event organized by the group has become a platform for the researchers from developing countries for knowledge sharing. Additionally, an international conference, Computers in Urban Planning and Urban Management Kupum was successfully organized at IIT Bombay by TSC Group in 1997. Professor Dingra is a founder of the Transportation Systems Engineering Group and served IIT for many years. He has also been associated with WCTR for more than two decades. Currently, he is the country area representative for the WCTRS. He serves as executive head of the Special Interest Group, SIG3, on safety analysis and policy of WCTRS, an international benefit and cost working group for ITS, IBEC ITS. Professor K. V. Krishna Rao joined IIT Bombay in 1996. He is a member of International Scientific Committee of WCTRS. Professor Tom Matthew is heading a multidisciplinary team on three major projects sponsored by Department of Information Technology, Government of India. Professor Gopal Patil and Professor Vedagiri joined the group in 2009. The Transportation System Studio has more than 30 computers installed with many important software including TransCAD, Cube, ArcGIS, Visim, Visum, Enlogit, Aimsun, etc. Highway Materials and Pavement Testing Laboratory and Traffic Engineering Laboratory are well equipped with the modern equipments and tools. The transportation group is dynamic and receives many renowned faculties and transportation professionals from all over the world. The infrastructure required for conducting large international conferences is available on the campus. About 15 parallel sessions can be held in the recently constructed state-of-the-art convention center. Lecture Hall Complex has more than 30 rooms fully equipped with audiovisuals. A Convocation Hall with a capacity of 1,500 seats is a suitable venue for inaugural sessions. Additionally, six meeting rooms are available. In addition to the existing guest houses and dormitories, a new 300-room guest house and two dormitories of 1,000 rooms are in the offing. Thus, by 2016, IIT Bombay can accommodate more than 800 delegates. Moreover, many 3-star and 5-star hotels are within 5-kilometer distance from IIT Bombay. With all its preparations and facilities, IIT Bombay and Mumbai is waiting to open its door to a future full of opportunities. As the director of this institute, I would like to assure you 
that all resources of the institute will be extended to make the conference WCTR 2016 a grand success. I am sure that it will prove to be a benchmark and the conference will be beneficial to the entire academic community working in this area both in India and abroad. Uh, we are hoping to receive a favorable response from you. Thank you.